Hello everybody, welcome back to another Premiere Pro tutorial. On this one, I'm going to show you how to create the cinematic look for any shot using pre-built stuff. This is stuff you do not have to buy. This is pre-built. It's already loaded into Premiere Pro. What am I talking about? Let me show you here. I've got this great looking footage of this lady with her head out of her truck doing her thing. But look on the left side here. This is the original footage. It's faded out. It's, it's just kind of blown out and washed out. It doesn't look very good. One click is all it took. Let's just go ahead and do it. I've also got another example right here. I've got this great looking shot here, if you, as you can see here as I just scroll through it. But when I unclick it and I take the effect off, it's again, it's, it's nice, but it, ain't, it isn't cinematic. So how did I do it? Let's just go and do it from scratch. Let's go ahead and delete all this stuff and we'll start from the beginning. First step, drag and drop some footage in like I've done here. Now go to Window Extensions, pardon me, Windows Workspace Color. Make sure you're in the Color Workspace. This loads up Lumetri Color. Under Lumetri Color, you get a whole bunch of options. Skip everything, click on Creative. When you go to Creative, you'll see something that says Look. Under Look, the first one, at least in my case, is Cinespace 2383S RGB blah blah blah. Apply that. It is overdone the effect. I know that. It's, it's probably too much for what you're looking for, but here's all you need to do. Dial down the intensity a little bit. Dial it back to about, let's say, maybe 52. That might be good. That's it. Now you have a great look. Add a little bit of sharpen in there just for effect. And this looks cinematic. If I hit play, that like looks like it belongs in a film. That's all you need to do, guys. Thanks for watching.